hello everyone and welcome back to my channel again hope you are all doing well so dear friends uh, we were discussing about the model question papers of the mathematics for the ec branch uh, students okay already i have uh, solved a variety of problems on the model question papers i have provided the link in the description box you can watch all those uh, questions over there okay today i will solve another question that is on the rank correlation okay it is also called as perman's rank correlation coefficient okay let's solve this question number 10c find the rank correlation for the following so box will be given like this one so you have to find out the rank correlation okay so while uh, writing the solution you have to first draw, draw these x and y here x and y just write down the values that our is uh, mentioned here so draw x and y accordingly okay then we are supposed to assign the ranks for these particular numbers rank is nothing but uh, the order means uh, uh, ascending order or descending order suppose in this particular x which is the minimum value see here uh, 36 if i am observing right so 36 is the minimum value so from uh, if i take the ascending order so i will just assign the rank as one over here okay then which is the next a smaller number that sorry greater number than 36 so 38 is the next one so i can assign rank as 2 okay then accordingly 38 uh, then 42 is another one but if i am observing 42 is repeating two times if that is the case so uh, what is the next rank which i can apply which i can assign for these two numbers that is three and four but uh, there are two repeating numbers uh, sorry this 42 is repeating two times here so i can take i have to take one three three is the another rank which can as which i can assign and another uh, rank is the fourth one okay these are the two numbers i have to just sum up these uh, two uh, ranks over here then divided by how many times it is repeat uh, repeating so 42 is two times repeating here so i can take two here okay so i will get four plus three is seven divided by two that is 3.5 is it is rank okay so i can just assign here 3.5 and here also 3.5 hope you are following then uh, next rank is uh, after four uh, so three and four are gone now now five is the another possibility five so let me check it here after 42 there is the number 47 okay so i can take five rank here after 47 there is 49 so six is the rank for this then accordingly uh, 49 55 yes 59 uh, sorry 55 seven is the rank for it okay then 55 56 so i can assign eight rank here okay then 63 is the another number so 9 is the rank for this 63 68 so 10 here and 69 here so 11 rank then for 72 12 is the rank okay it is nothing but the order increasing order or decreasing order you can take decreasing order also but i have taken here the increasing order 36 is the minimum number then uh, 38 is the greater than greater than 36 for uh, then 42 is greater than 38 like that you have to take the uh, rank over here okay so i can write here now rx is the rank for the x values okay so i can take here uh, for 30 uh, sorry for 56 what is the rank 8 yes for 56 rank is 8 then for 42 3.5 is the rank and for 72 12 is the rank okay likewise you have to write down here 3.5 12 1 9 5 7 6 2 3.5 and again 10 and 11 these are the ranks which i have written in the above uh, box over here okay so this is rank for x values now rank for y so, so you see here uh, what is the minimum number in this case i think 150 115 is the minimum number so i can assign rank as 1 then 1 118 so i can assign 2 as rank here then 118 uh, 125 okay 3 rank here okay then 125 128 so 4 here okay 128 then 140 so i can res uh, assign the rank as 5 then 142 145 6 is the rank 145 to 147 so 5 6 7 is the rank here okay then 147 to 149 8 9 here okay 152 so 10 i can take here then 155 11 160 that is 12 so these are this is the rank in terms of increasing order now i have to write down these ranks in uh, here in the below box over here okay so for 147 what is the rank 7 
okay likewise i can write here 3 12 2 8 4 9 6 1 5 10 11 i hope you are getting this is the ranks for these particular numbers 147 is 7 okay 125 is 3 so i have written here 3 160 12 is the rank 12 is the rank likewise you have to write down okay so now di i have to take differences of these ranks that is rx minus ry so 8 minus 7 is 1 3.5 minus 3 is 0 0.5 okay 12 minus 12 is 0 1 minus 2 is minus 1 1 1 7 minus 9 is minus 2 6 minus 6 is 0 2 minus 1 is 1 that is uh, minus 1.5 0 0 okay hope you are getting d1 square is uh, it is square of this term so 1 square is 1 0 0.5 square is 0 0.25 0 1 1 1 and next is 4 0 1 1 1.5 into 1.5 that is 2.25 0 square is 0 0 okay now i have to take summation of this di square this is because there is a formula so i can just take some up here summation of di square which is equal to 2.25 plus 0 0.25 that is 2.5 3.5 7.5 8.5 9.5 10.5 11.5 i am getting here summation okay now there is a formula which i have to put down so that i can get the rank correlation so now i can write down write down the formula so formula is for a rank correlation it is denoted by rho which is equal to 1 minus 6 times summation of d square plus 1 upon 12 m1 cube minus m1 okay divided by n cube minus n okay so this n is the number of terms 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 so n is 12 in case here okay and this is m1 what is the m1 it is the repeating terms means how much how many times the re, uh, terms are repeating so you see in this first case i uh, 42 is repeating two times or twice okay that is it is here m m1 if uh, in the another uh, suppose y there are another terms of uh, sorry there are another repeating terms i can take that one as m2 but in this case only in the first that is x uh, row only the uh, terms are repeating okay that is why i am taking only m1 here in the formula otherwise uh, it can be expanded up to m2 m3 m it depends upon the problem if in two rows uh, the terms are repeating you have to take accordingly then plus 1 by 12 m2 m2 cube minus m2 like that okay so in next videos maybe if i do the problems on this particular concept so definitely i will show you how to calculate uh, how to expand this formula okay now let me put down the values in this case over here so 1 minus 6 summation of d square we have calculated it as 11.5 so 11.5 plus 1 upon 12 m1 cube m1 is here 2 right so 2 cube minus 2 divided by n cube n is 12 in this case that is number of terms so 12 cube minus 12 if you just calculate this in the calci over there so you will get a row is equal to 0.95 this is the answer for this particular question this is very easy problem so i have completed the questions from this particular chapter that is curve fitting for the ec students or triple e students <laughs>